Hey everyone, this is Cami from the Life of Cami, and this is my friend. I'm Laurel from laurelalina.com. And tonight we want to talk to you about all the joys of dating, specifically four things, okay? So let's talk about arranged marriages and the fact that I am a firm supporter of arranged marriages. Like my goal in life is to be on that show Married at First Sight. I'm just saying, I think that if we're already married, we can totally make it work. <laughs> I've also had a couple friends like sign me up for arranged marriage or sign me up for the Married at First Sight. Could be fun, just saying. And they're coming to Phoenix, so. <laughs> and I want to talk about ghosting because that is so frustrating. If you feel like you hit it off on the first date, second date, whatever, and they don't contact you again, like how many text messages is too much before you decide that they're not into you anymore? I think it's like right around the 18 number. Like that's kind of when you're contacting Liam Neeson because you're like, <laughs> this guy's gotta be taken. Like that's <laughs> the only excuse for why he's not responding. Right. Or like when you're over 30 and single, and so therefore you get set up with people that are over 30 and single. Like, okay, we have one thing in common, and it's the fact that neither one of us are married. This has to work, right? That's relatable. One of my worst setups, well, I shouldn't say one of my worst, but it was a recent one, and he was over 30. I'm approaching 30, and I guess she thought it would be a good match because of that. Anyway, he takes me to this restaurant, which was his idea. He researched it and everything. Uh, he took me to Steak and Stone, and the first thing that he did when he opened up the menu was said, wow, this place is expensive. So being timid and a little bit shy, and I don't feel like I wanna order the most expensive thing on the menu, because I'm not like that, I order a side salad, and he gets the fajitas, which is the second most cheap thing on the menu so who, who orders fajitas at, <laughs> at steak and stone? stone like come on people <laughs> just don't do that no. don't don't tell your date how expensive a place is when it was your idea to take her there that right there is like telling the girl that she needs to eat before you go out on the date right. and then buying her a shot glass of hot chocolate <laughs> i'm just saying right now like that's what's happening in that moment okay no 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 you give me that 32 ounce mug and that huge slice of chocolate cake that is what we need to have happen. Yes. But anyways, you gotta find the joy in dating.